Hey, get your hands up in the air. Let's go clapping. Let's get it going. Up, up. We have something to celebrate today, Purchase. Oh, right.
Welcome. First of all, thank you to the band. You've been listening to Joe Ferry. <laughs> Joe Ferry and the Great Ska Band, many of whom are Purchase alum. On vocals and keyboards, Dana Mancuso. Dan Cotman on guitar. Neil Spitzer on sax. On drums, Dave Lewitt. Alan Bowers, and on bass, Joe Ferry. We've had many staff who've worked today 
to produce this commencement and to organize it, and a lot of work goes into it. The, the staff was led by Keisha Martin, and the commencement committee is listed on page 52 in your program, and let's have a round of applause for them. Now, would you please rise for the national anthem, sung by Rosemary Albanese. Rosemary is a candidate for the Bachelor of Music degree in voice performance from the Conservatory of Music, and she plans to continue her studies in opera at the Aaron Copeland School of Music in Queens College this fall. Good afternoon, graduates of the class of 2018, parents, relatives, friends of the graduates, members of the faculty, staff, and administration, and distinguished guests. I'm Thomas Schwartz, president of Purchase College, State University of New York. It is my pleasure to welcome you to the 46th annual commencement exercises. <laughs> Joining me today on the dais are dignitaries, friends of the college, members of our various foundation boards, our deans, directors, and chairs, our faculty, our officers, and members of the college council. I will introduce at this time those members of the platform party who will not be introduced later in the ceremony, may I ask each as I introduce you to stand and to remain standing until all are introduced. I would ask the audience to please hold your applause until all have been recognized. New York State Assemblyman District 93, David Buckwald. From the Purchase College Council, alumni representative Paula Cancro, class of 1979, Demetrius McRae, President of the Purchase College Student Government. I knew that would happen. <laughs> Trustee and Chair of the Purchase College Foundation, Lucille Werlinick. Trustees of the Purchase College Foundation, David Fleischer, Class of 76, William Klingenstein, and Scheuer. 
Dean of Student Affairs, Patricia Bice. Dean of Enrollment Management, Caitlin Reed. Director of the Teaching, Learning, and Technology Center, Keith Landa, unfortunately cannot be here because of trees falling up where he lives. Director of the Newbergen Museum and Associate Professor of Art History, Tracy Fitzpatrick. Director of the Performing Arts Center, Seth Soloway. UUP Chapter President and Assistant for Instructional Technology, Joseph Germani, and the Faculty Marshals. The, there are members from our outstanding faculty who will be retiring this year, and I want to recognize them for their long-term and long-lasting contributions and dedication to the college and its students. Two of our retirees are serving as Faculty Marshals. Director of the Library and Faculty Marshal, Patrick Callahan. Patrick, for 20 years, close to 20 years, has been instrumental in the transformation of the library from almost entirely print to largely digital. Under his leadership, the library has become a technology center in support of research and instructional development. We owe him a debt of gratitude for envisioning and implementing what is now an essential and vital hub for our students and faculty members' academic lives. Our second faculty marshal is our Dean of Liberal Arts and Sciences and Vice Provost for Academic Affairs, Suzanne Kessler. A professor of psychology for the last 30 years she joined the faculty in 1972. During her tenure, she has contributed to the formation of the psychology and gender studies programs, been a staunch advocate for the rights of women and underserved populations, and furthered the cause of liberal education. For the past 14 years, she has served as an invaluable administrator. She was appointed Dean of the School of Natural and Social Sciences in 2004, and then appointed to her current role in 2010. Dean Kessler has been a steadfast and devoted member of the college and the recipient of numerous awards. We are indebted to her for this remarkable 46-year career of service to the college. <laughs> Our mace carrier, our mace carrier is distinguished service professor and professor of chemistry, Joseph Scrivenick. A member, a member of the faculty for nearly 40 years, Professor Scrivenick is also the founder and director of the Baccalaureate and Beyond Bridges program. For more than 20 years, this program has had a positive impact on hundreds of students who have transitioned from community colleges into four-year colleges. This successful program is being replicated throughout the SUNY system with a goal of operating within six regions and 30 SUNY two-year and four-year institutions. In 2011, President Obama presented Dr. Scrivenick with the Presidential Award for Excellence in Science, Mathematics, and Engineering Mentoring the highest national mentoring award bestowed by the White House. I would also like to recognize the following faculty and staff members who are retiring. Graciela Abarca, Barbara Giorgio, Teresa McElwain, Janine Meyer, Suzanne Werner, and Lynn Winters. We thank them for their many years of service. They contributed greatly to our students and the achievement of Purchase College. Our New York State University Police Color Guard, Police Officer Danny David, Police Officer Francesco D'Astanzo, Police Officer Adrian Jordan, and Police Officer Amanda Rothenbucher. The College Officers, Vice President for Student Affairs and Enrollment Management, Dennis Craig, Chief Financial Officer and Vice President of Operations, Judy Nolan, 
Vice President for Institutional Advancement and Executive Director of the Purchase College Foundation and Charitable Entities, Catherine Broad. And from our administration, Kathleen Farrell, Chief Human Resources Office, Officer, Jerima DeWeiss, Chief Diversity Officer and Affirmative Action Officer and Title IX Coordinator. Now, join me in welcoming all of the members to the, of the platform program. Will our esteemed and talented faculty and staff who guided this class please stand? And now will the parents, families, and friends of the graduates also stand? Now, the degree candidates of 2018, will you please rise and be recognized? And now, let's all rise, because we, without each other, Without each other, this day would not happen. I am now pleased to introduce an honored guest and a regular attendee at our commencement here today to congratulate the graduating class of 2018, our senior United States Senator from New York and minority leader of the Democratic Caucus, Senator Charles Schumer. Now in his third term, Senator Schumer has been a tireless advocate for New Yorkers on challenges ranging from important infrastru energy infrastructure initiatives to public health. Over this past year, he has connected with New Yorkers and their businesses across the state with his support for policies and legislation that paved the way for expanding economic opportunities. He continues to be an advocate for improved access to quality and affordable education. As Democratic leader, Senator Schumer does not serve on any committees in the Senate, but most recently served as ranking member of the Committee on Senate Rules and Administration, the Senate Judiciary, Finance, Banking, Housing, and Urban Affairs Committees, and was the ranking member of the Subcommittee on Immigration, Refugees, and Border Securities. A product of Brooklyn Public Schools, Senator Schumer graduated from Harvard College and Harvard Law School and was elected to the New York State Assembly at age 23, and he was elected to Congress at age 29. It's my pleasure to introduce Senator Schumer. Thank you. Tom, you're great. Did you take my note? Yes. First, I want to repay the compliment. You know, SUNY Purchase is one of the best schools of higher learning not just in Westchester or New York, but in our country. And under the leadership of your president, Tom Schwartz, and his whole team, it's gone to amazing heights. We are all lucky that Purchase is here in New York and in Westchester. So congratulations, Tom. Now, let me add my congratulations to the class SUNY Purchase 2018. Congratulations! Now first, I'd like to announce my class gift. I have a gift for you. Mm -hmm. Just listen. You're a tough group, I know. It's hard to pay for college, isn't it? And graduate school. If you're poor, the federal government helps you out. That's good. But what about the middle class? 
So, a few years ago, I wrote a law that said you or your parents, whoever's paying for college, can take as a full tax credit $2,500 off their federal taxes every, for every year you pay tuition, college and graduate school, provided, Washington, there's always a provided, provided your family income is below $200,000 a year. So, if you come from a family that makes below 200000 make sure you or mom or dad takes that tax credit. Uh, last year, about a quarter of all the people who are entitled to it didn't do it because it's new. If you forgot either last year or the previous two years, you can fill out a simple form with the IRS and get a check of up to $7,500 back in the mail. Not a bad class gift. Now, graduates, what happens if you come from a family that makes above $200,000 a year? God bless you. I want to say a word to the moms and dads there. I know how you feel. A few short years ago, my wife Iris and I sat where you did, watched our daughter come up on the platform, get a diploma. It was one of the greatest days of our lives. And you know, these days, as you know, raising kids isn't easy, and maybe you were like us. You think back to the tough times. We thought back, Jessica was four months old. She had 106 and a half fever. We rushed her to the hospital. We didn't think she'd make it. Praise God, she did. We then put her, I remembered when we put her on the kindergarten bus for the first time. As the bus pulled away, she ran to the back of the bus, waved out the back window, tears streaming down her little cheeks. But when Iris went to meet her on the bus's return at 2 o'clock, she bounded off the bus happy as could be. She said, Mommy, I came back. <laughs> when we talked to her that night, we realized what was going on in her little brain. She thought that was it. New parents, new brother and sister, new room, new house, new family. Then we remember Jessie as a teenager when she didn't say much to us. And when she did, we didn't understand the word she said. And then moms and dads, you see your sons and daughters come up on that stage, get that diploma, and become an adult before your very eyes. Let's hear it for the moms and dads. Job well done. One more word of thanks. One more word of thanks. So we're having a great afternoon here. But as we speak, there are young men and young women, many your age, many from this community, this area, who have enlisted in our armed forces. They are overseas, many in dangerous places, Iraq, Afghanistan. They are risking their lives for our freedom, our American way of life. Let's have a round of applause for them as well. Now, to this great class, SUNY Purchase 2018, you are graduating at a time of enormous change across the country, around the world. Profound economic change, profound social change. The world is moving so very, very fast. For instance, in the old days, when you graduated from college, the odds were pretty high that you'd have the same job or at least work in the same field for the next 40 years. That's not so true anymore. Many of you will have several jobs, a good number, several careers. Along with those economic changes, the Internet has put so much information at your fingertips, it's sometimes hard to figure out what's important and to distinguish between what's true and what is not. Even around the world, there are all kinds of changes, many not for the better. When I went to college, words like terrorism and mass shootings were not even heard of. So, for times are tough. They're changing. They're different. But here's the good news. Your generation is better equipped to adapt to and cope with these new changes than any generation before you. First, you've gotten a great education. Only about one-third of all the young people your age will get any degree. And you have gotten a degree that's better than just about any other one. So you've gotten a great education. Of course, you have families that will always have your back through thick and thin. And one other advantage you have, you're the first generation to be born into all this new technology. You know, your parents, your teachers, me, we try to get used to it, but you were born into it. Technology to you is like water is to a fish. You've been swimming in it your whole lives. So for those three reasons and many others, your generation is better equipped 
to overcome the obstacles this new world presents, better equipped to seize all the opportunities that this new world presents, and better equipped to pursue your passions. Dream big dreams and maybe even accomplish big things. But right now, sitting in your seats, you may not be so sure what's going to come next. With so much of the world changing, it may feel sometimes like you're jumping into an abyss. But the key graduates is not to fear change or fear the unknown. It's to embrace it. It's to relish it. It's to soak it up. Don't let one setback, no matter how overwhelming it seems, stand in your way. Because if you embrace change and don't let fear of failure deter you, the odds, with your advantages, the odds are very high you will succeed. Now, how do I know these things? Well, I experienced things like this when I was graduating. About several decades back, when I was seated at graduation, I had just learned that I had won a scholarship to travel all around the world, all expenses paid for a whole year. For me, it was the opportunity of a lifetime. I was a kid from Brooklyn. I had never been out of the country before. But graduates, at the same time, I met a girl, and I fell in love. Aww. So class, I had to decide. Do I go around the world on the all-expense-paid scholarship for a whole year? Or do I stay home with the girl, my first true love? Class of 2018, what would you have done? <laughs> President Schwartz, the class is divided. I stayed home with the girl. There's some romantics over there clapping. Don't clap yet, the story unfolds. That, that summer, she went on a brief vacation, and I went to the airport to meet her on her return. As soon as she got off the plane, I saw by the look on her face, something was the matter. She dumped me by Labor Day. There I was, no scholarship, no trip around the world, no girl. I said to myself, what a loser you are. Hang it up. Nothing that good is ever going to happen. You're never going to get anywhere. And in fact, I stayed in my house for several months, moped around, felt sorry for myself. But I overcame it. I dusted myself off. And a few years later, I found myself seated at graduation once again, this time from law school. But on the way home from law school, I told mom and dad I was not going to join the fancy law firm like we had planned. I told them I loved politics. I told them my dream was to run for office, even though the chances of winning seemed remote. My parents were shocked. My mother was particularly disappointed, you see. I came from a working class family. My father was an exterminator, never went to college. We never had much money. And the law firm was paying $400 a week, which in those days was more money than my family had ever seen. But my dream was to run for office, and so that summer and fall, against very long odds, I ran for the New York State Assembly, and I had three opponents. First, there was the party machine candidate. Then there was a neighborhood activist. But then there was my mother, who was telling all her friends not to vote for me. <laughs> she did. So she, as she said, I get this dumb idea of being a politician out of your big, thick head. Well, graduates, a few years earlier, I sure as heck didn't get that girl. But that November, I won the election. So, to the graduates, SUNY Purchase 2018, on this day of your great achievement, my advice for you is take the risk. Don't let fear of failing deter you. You know, for those of us who've gotten a little older and we look back on life, one of the most difficult things to look back on is what I call the what-ifs. What if I had only done that? What if I had only gone there? So my advice to the class of 2018 is simple. Go for it. You're about to cast off into the unknown. Admittedly, it can sometimes seem scary. 
but you've got great assets, great education, great families, knowledge of technology. So garner up your courage, garner up your strength, put aside your doubts, take a chance. And if you do, it is not only my hope, it's not only my prayer, it is indeed my confidence that you, each of you, will find true success and true joy in life. To this great class, SUNY Purchase 2018, congratulations. Good luck. Godspeed, and don't forget, go for it. And when you get a chance again, go on the scholarship. Thank you, Senator. I think uh, his advice is uh, right on, and I want to couple it with some thoughts that uh, will, I think, carry you forward. On April 30th, the New York Times ran a full-page article entitled, After Prairie Fires, Strangers Sell Send Help in Bales. The article was about trucks of hay that were delivered to ranchers in Oklahoma after wildfires burned the prairie. Without the hay, these ranchers would not have been able to feed their cattle. The hay came from as far as Michigan, more than a thousand miles away sent by ranchers who didn't know the Oklahoma ranchers. It was free. As one of them said, it's just what you do. What struck me about the article were two things. The sending of the free hay was a much bigger story in the New York Times than the wildfires had been. And second, how the free hay reminded me of what I have seen on this campus for years purchase students coming to the aid of purchase students, whether known to them or not. What tied the ranchers together from all over the country was only that they were all ranchers. Very few knew the ranchers they were helping. Here, of course, on the purchase campus, more often students do know each other, but I realized that when I stepped back from the existing student body, and look at those who came before, the alumni, there is more of a parallel. Purchase students help purchase students, and purchase alumni help purchase alumni, as well as students, who they do not know. I have seen time and again students getting internships or jobs with purchase alumni, whether in the arts or elsewhere, and their only connection was purchase, just like the ranchers out west whose only connection was ranching. You have helped and supported each other here many times, both in good times and most recently in tragic. I am constantly moved to see how you support each other in your senior projects and presentations, how when you believe there has been an injustice to one, you rise to the occasion together. You are about to join the Purchase Alumni, a group of 26,000 people in the arts, in business, in education, all over the country, and indeed the world. You need to continue to reach out and support each other. Use LinkedIn and other social media to find Purchase Alumni who are in professional fields you want to join or cities in which you want to live. I think you will find that they will be happy to help. Don't think that this little act of reaching out is inconsequential. Just making the contact could have life-changing consequences. A new friend, a job, even a partner. Small acts often have large consequences. And now that you are about to be alumni, our alumni office is available to help you as well. 
A bale is straw bundled together. You too are bundled together by your connection to purchase. And if you send bales to someone you don't know, who knows what you may get in return. So when you take Senator Schumer's advice to reach for it, recognize that you can reach for it with help of your fellow alumni. Thank you and God bless you. certificates. <laughs> Where are the certificates? Oh, they said water for you. They're on the table. They're on the table. They're on the table. David's going to hand it to me. Okay, got help. See what you can do with a little help from your friends? It is the tradition of the Academy to honor individuals of preeminence, influence, and service within their chosen fields through a variety of means. A President's Award for Distinguished Alumni marks the occasion of a maturing institution and honors distinguished alumni whose demonstrated excellence and significant contributions within their chosen fields reflects on the quality of their educational experience at Purchase. We are confident that our alumni, poised as they are for the roles of major influence and contribution, will continue to emerge worthy of these awards. The audience will find brief description of today's two alumni honorees on pages eight and nine in the commencement program. Purchase College Foundation trustee and a member of the class of 1976, David Fleischer, will you please assist me with the presentation of the President's Award for Alumni Achievement and join me. Now we have it. Okay. The first recipient of the 2018 President's Award for Distinguished Alumni is Jay Alcott Sanders. Will you please join us? We are honored to present you with this citation which reads, in part, Jay Alcott Sanders, Distinguished Alumnus. Whereas you received a BFA in theater arts as a member as a member of the Purchase College class of 1976 and were elected to be the School of Arts commencement speaker that year, whereas you were the first person to audition and be accepted into the theater arts program by the renowned founding dean of the theater and film program, Norris Houghton, Whereas among your favorite early roles in the first years of the Purchase College Theater Arts Program were Willie Lohman in Death of a Salesman, and in response to a campus-wide search for a name for the very first yearbook, you coined our seminal college phrase, proof of purchase. 
whereas you have appeared in more plays presented by the public theater Shakespeare in the Park than any other actor to date. Beginning in, beginning in the first summer following your graduation when you were cast in both Henry V and Measure for Measure. Whereas for over 40 years you have been a regular presence at the public theater, most recently appearing in Richard Nelson's celebrated four Apple Family plays and the trilogy The Gabriel Family, Election Year in the Life of One Family, both productions touring Europe and beyond. Whereas you made your Broadway debut in 1979 alongside Kevin Klein and fellow alum Jody Long in Loose Ends by re and receiving very favorable reviews in the New York Times. And whereas this year you starred as Chekhov's Uncle Vanya and the Los Angeles Times theater critic in reviewing your lead performance hailed you as quote, an unsung national treasure, bringing your clarifying intelligence and emotional muscle to the role. Whereas your skillful acting has consistently landed you numerous roles in film, including JFK, The Day After Tomorrow, Angels in the Outfield, and in television shows such as Sneaky Pete, True Detective, Blind Spot, and Law and Order, to name a few. Whereas you are a playwright, an author, and a prominent narrator of numerous documentaries and audiobooks. Recently, your play, Unexplored Interior, about the 1994 Rwandan genocide, was chosen to be the inaugural production of Washington, D.C.'s new Mosaic Theater. Whereas you are indeed proof of purchase, you use your acting skills in benevolent ways, particularly at your alma mater, where for over 20 years you have been returning annually to teach master classes to both the freshman and senior conservatory of theater arts students. Now therefore, do I, Thomas J. Schwartz, president on behalf of the faculty, students, and staff of Purchase College, State University of New York, proudly recognize J. Olcott Sanders, recipient of the Purchase College President's Award for Distinguished Alumni presented on this 18th day of May, 2018. Wow. Uh, I'm going to keep it short because I know what these things are like. Right? You want to get on with your lives. Thank you, President Schwartz. This means a lot to me, obviously. I hear all this description and I think, God, I want to meet that guy. That's a good sign. When I graduated in 1976, having studied and prepared here as an artist, I was focused on asserting, proving, and establishing myself out in the world on being seen as competent, promising, viable. I was ready to show off all I knew. But over time, I came to learn that my greatest strength was actually my vulnerability, my peace with what I don't know, my acceptance of my own unsureness. Instead of trying to get things right and knowing all the answers, my focus became all about listening, staying open, and asking better questions. The question we all must answer and evolve for ourselves, because it does change, is how do I define success? Money, awards, love, being the best person you can be, the best artist, the best friend, shaking the world, or making the world a better place. Find your own damn way. In your own time. Stay open. Keep learning. Forgive yourselves and others. Love deeply. Enjoy your youth and embrace getting older and be kind. 
unnecessarily kind. Be very, very kind. Thank you very much. Get on with it. Our next recipient of the 2018 President's Award for Distinguished Alumni is Latrice Monique Walker. Will you please join us? We are honored to present you with this citation, which reads, in part, Latrice Monique Walker, Distinguished Alumnus. Whereas you received a BA in Sociology and Political Science as a member of the Purchase College class of 2001, and then went on to earn your JD from Pace University in 2006, and was admitted to the New York Bar in 2007. Whereas a native New Yorker committed to helping your community of Brownsville and Brooklyn, you started a career in government as counsel to Congresswoman Yvette Clark soon after graduating from law school. Whereas in your capacity as counsel, you gained firsthand experience in community planning and development to improve your community. Whereas you were elected to the New York State Assembly in 2014, where you devote your energies to your constituents, supporting affordable housing, and defending the rights of tenants and young minorities unable to advocate for themselves. <clears throat> Whereas you are the chair of the New York State Association of Black and Puerto Rican Legislators, <clears throat> and serve on the execu executive committee of the Black Puerto Rican Hispanic Asian Caucus, and in 2018, you became a member of Zeta Phi Beta Sorority Sigma Kappa Zeta Chapter, <laughs> of which you're very proud, I know. <laughs> Whereas your level of commitment is evident in your personal life as a founding member of the Ocean Hill Brownsville Coalition of young professionals, as well as the activities of the Wayside Baptist Church. Whereas the experiences you had growing up in Prospect Plaza, witnessing the displacement of residents, including your mother, and the impact it had on your community, have shaped your focus as a legislator on fair housing, economic development, and crime victims and their families. Whereas you excelled as a student in the college's educational opportunity program and have chosen to give back to this program as a mentor and role model, inspiring dozens of students over the past several years. Now, therefore, do I, Thomas J. Schwartz, president, on behalf of the alumni, faculty, students, and staff of Purchase College, State University of New York, proudly recognize Latrice Monique Walker recipient of the Purchase College President's Award for Distinguished Alumni, presented on this 18th day of May, 2018. like I should say Wakanda forever. <laughs> Good afternoon, everyone. It is a special blessing to be here. I feel like this is my do-over moment. Not everybody gets to do their graduation all over again, but this time I'm on the stage. So it is an honor to be here uh, with my mom uh, and also my, my colleague's mom, Assemblywoman Diana Richardson, and also my colleague in government, David Buckwall, who is your assembly member uh, here at Purchase College. I am so excited to be here today for the 46th commencement ceremony, and I would like to thank President Schwartz for honoring me with this prestigious award 
and Dean Kessler, the faculty, staff, and most importantly, the students for having me here today. Additionally, I would like to thank Paul Nicholson. I know, we gotta give it up for Paul. Renev Sorhendo, who was my executive director at the time, Mary Garcia, and the rest, yes, and the rest of my EOP family here at SUNY Purchase, or Purchase College. I come from a neighborhood that few people can say they grew up to become a lawyer, a judge, or even an assemblywoman. But I wouldn't say that I am an exception to any rule. I am just an example of what greatness can come out of that little neighborhood in Brooklyn we know of as Brownsville. I can honestly say that I owe a great deal of that to EOP where many people counted me out before giving me a chance. EOP handed me the opportunity that propelled me to where I am today. And one of the things that I love to say is that they thought that they could bury me, but they didn't realize that we were seeds. This commencement is more than just a celebration, even though you have a lot to celebrate. It is about empowering one another because each and every one of you are the future of this great country. We have to work together for the advancement of one another and the advancement of our communities. And if everyone is moving forward together collectively, then success and triumph can take care of itself. Just a few years ago, I walked the halls of Purchase College. I was focused and determined, and when I, when I was a little girl, I wanted to grow up to be the best actress that the world had ever seen. But as many of you know, and what you will learn as you go off and do amazing things, the path that you plan to walk isn't always the path you are destined to walk. As this chapter finishes and another one begins, do not be discouraged with the journey when the journey gets tough. You never know where the road may take you. As the great President Obama said, the cynics may be the loudest voices, but I promise you they will accomplish the least. God bless you and congratulations to the class of 2018. It is now my pleasure to introduce the 2018 senior class speaker, Alex Lally. <laughs> Alex is a design tech ma technology major in the Conservatory of Theater Arts and, and, and a three-sport athlete. Alex. Hello and welcome, Purchase faculty, staff, administration, and family, friends, and my fellow graduates. I come from a small country town called Sunnyvale in the big state of Texas. So you can imagine what a culture shock, the real kind, it was for me when I first walked onto the Purchase campus in 2013. It was winter time and this Texas girl had only seen snow a handful of times. This was way before I heard the term Thunder snow, snowmageddon, or snowpocalypse. The two days I was here visiting, it was a blizzard with a total accumulation of three inches. <laughs> but that blizzard didn't scare me, and I fell in love with everything purchased, and I committed before I even flew back home. I was ready to make my mark on the world. Over the course of my time here, I've had some amazing professors, and I've met some life-changing people. However, there's one instructor who has made a big impact on how I have lived the past four and a half years. That would be Peter Polinsky, an academic advisor in the Advising Center and himself a proud Purchase grad. I had Peter for my college writing class freshman year, and I will be honest, like most freshmen, college writing was not my favorite class. But during one class when I'd been half asleep through most of it, 
we were talking about Friedrich Nietzsche, and that's when I heard the phrase, live life as a work of art. That one phrase woke me up, and I started to really pay attention to what was being said. Peter had us talk about what we thought Nietzsche meant, and we discussed how you can actually live like a piece of artwork. The way I see it now, the moment you are born, you are a blank canvas. And as you live your life, your picture is being painted. That means the good, the bad, and even the ugly are painted on this canvas for all the world to see. Therefore, every decision you make, whether it is in private or public, is painted on this canvas that is your life. That class changed everything for me. It made me realize I want my life, my artwork, to be colorful, to be beautiful. I want to be able to show people with pride how I've overcome hard times, how I don't let people or things define who I am. I've always been one to want to do everything I possibly can. And this quote, live life as a work of art, made me realize that it's not important to do everything, but it's important to give 100% to everything you do. Purchase has given me the opportunity to do just that. I've been an assistant set designer for four plays, a set designer for three. I've played three different varsity sports. Purchase is a place where you can fit in no matter what crazy thing you are into. I am a volleyball player, a swimmer, a lacrosse player, an artist, a designer, and yes, even a professional mermaid. <laughs> <laughs> Purchase has also been a place of growth. I've spent five years finding out what it is I believe in and finding out what it is I believe in and being open to change, like changing your major, which for me happened not once, but twice. Coming from a small conservative Texas town, I really had to learn to think wide open. I've learned about politics, preferred pronouns, gender identity, drag shows, and sexuality. I have created a family here. I have friends in different majors, from different backgrounds, with different points of views, and I wouldn't change it for anything. As a class, we have seen and been, seen and been a part of the world's changes. We have had the first woman presidential candidate speak on our campus, participated in the Black Lives Matter protest, the It's On Us and Me Too movements. We are a community of artists, athletes, musicians, scientists, filmmakers, historians, philosophers, dancers, and we all have come together to make our artwork better. We, the class of 2018, are part of Purchase's masterpiece. Together, we are proof of Purchase. So go out there and make your art. Make the most of every opportunity you have. And if you fail and fall down, that's okay. Get up, learn from it, and move on. As Nelson Mandela said, it always seems impossible until it's done. So think back on all those hard times, the all-nighters you pulled, the times you thought you couldn't finish it, whatever that it might have been for you, and look where you are sitting now. The finish line is within our grasp, and we are about to cross it, all of us together. So congr congratulations, class of 2018. Now proceed with the conferring of degrees. <laughs> Mr. President, as Provost of Purchase College, I have the honor on behalf of the administration, faculty, and staff to present to you the college's 2018 degree candidates, and I ask with pride that you confer upon them the degrees which they have earned and to which they are entitled. I would respectfully invite Elizabeth Robertson member of the Purchase College Council to join you in the presentation of degrees and assisting Elizabeth Robertson is presiding officer of the faculty and chair of the College Senate, associate professor of theater design technology, Dan Hanessian. The deans will introduce the chairs and directors who will welcome the candidates from their respective schools and conservatories. The names of the candidates will be read by Pamela Prather, assistant, pro assistant professor of theater and performance in the Conservatory of Theater Arts, and J. Elliott Lewis, 
Assistant Professor of Journalism in the School of Humanities. This is a very important day for our graduates. I ask that the students, faculty, staff, and family members please remain seated until all graduates' names have been read. Please do not allow your loud cheers to drown out the next name, the name of the next candidate. Today we celebrate a purchase tradition, the passing of the brick. Four years ago, an incoming freshman from the class of 2018 was given a brick at orientation. A symbol of purchase and the achievement of our students, the class of 2018 brick has been safeguarded for the past four years. And in a little while, one of your classmates, Chase Andrzejewski, AKA Naomi Applebottom, <laughs> will hand the class of 2018 brick back to the president when he comes up to receive his diploma. It is now my pleasure to introduce Peggy DeCook Acting Dean, School of the Arts. Director of Art and Design, Steve Lamb, will help welcome to the stage the degree candidates in Art and Design. Mr. President, on behalf of the Faculty of Art and Design, I have the honor to present the candidates for the degree of Bachelor of Fine Arts in Bachelor of Science. Emmanuel Apia Afori. <laughs> Alexis Belt. <laughs> Lily Delilah Bua. <laughs> Nikki Bursia. <laughs> Jazz Kagan. <laughs> Danielle Francesca Caleo. <laughs> Selena Marcella Carney. Jake Sarasso, Kevin Savios, Paula Cortina, Madeline Margaret Kramer, Samantha Crone, Andres De Jesus. Jillian Hannah Dolan, Olivia Christine Donner, Sarah Fakruden, Ariana Falzerano, Jonathan Flores, Leah Catherine Forbes. Jordan X. Ford. Madeline Jackson Friedman. Isabel Ann Galstian. Bridget Eileen Geddes. Catherine Denise Koiburu. Christopher James Graham. Tarali Corley Green, Anthony Joseph Gualiardo, Namisha Priscilla Gupta, Carolyn Haldeman Emerling, Katie Mary Haynes, Giancarlo Stefan Hernandez. Arthur Lyons Hunking. <laughs> Hannah Beth Hutchinson. <laughs> Noah Richard Jackson. <laughs> Nicole Marie Jones. <laughs> Mark Anthony Kelly. <laughs> Haley Rose Canadal. Meredith Ellen Lawhead. Kimberly Ann Linder. Jessica Logan. Sterling J. Mahoney. Madison Michelle Marr. Ivana Rosita Minucci. 
Kelly Lorraine Mertz. Michael Angel Niamanatakis. Vanessa H. Wynn. Facio Ulagan. Stephanie Michelle Oliveri. Nicholas S.C. O'Malley. Valeria? Valeria Orozco. Amanda Rosa Otero. Daisy Padilla Gutierrez. Daniel Edward Patino. Justin Peacock. Talia Zahara Perez. Caitlin Jenny Persichelli. Alexandra Pozniak. Alexandra Palmira Price. Jason Quispe. Ciara Drew Ramos. Adiana Marie Riviera. Selwyn Rocha. August Santiago. Kaylin Savino. Tiana Christine Shippa. Tyler Jerome Schrader. Zuri Von Francis Selden Jordan. Jairo Andre Serna. Alexander William Shear. Jacqueline Siciliano. George Fletcher Simons. Galen Smith. Taylor Elise Speed. Catherine A. Sweeney. Alyssa Claire Swiderski. Khalif Thompson. Sierra Noel Torres. Samantha Tyson. Sena Vanderveen. Noel Velez. Spencer Michael Wynott. Cleo E. Walton. Alexandra Michelle Belsky. Melanie Lauer. Carol Ann Melnick. Sabrina Isabel Selka. Mr. President, on behalf of the Faculty of Art and Design, I now have the honor to present the candidates for the degree of Master of Fine Arts. Kelsey Taylor Broad. Bridget Megan McGuire. Samuel Linkowski Spillman. Gako Tutsiaya. Charlotte B. Wolf. Assistant Dean, School of Liberal Studies, Director of Liberal Studies and Arts Management and Entrepreneurship, Trudy Milburn, will help welcome to the stage the degree candidates in Arts Management in Entrepreneurship. Mr. President, on behalf of the Faculty of Arts Management in Entrepreneurship, I have the honor to welcome and present the candidates for the degree of Bachelor of Arts. Colin G. McCletchy. Megan Jesse McCletchy. 
Yasmin Baratali, Tia Marie Barrier, Ryan James Bartlett, James H. Basum, Eloise Lynn Bruce, Elizabeth M. Corey, Allison Marie Duncan, Allison Elizabeth Edie, Lorena Sofia Peralta, Justine J. Germain, Natasha Ruth Calixte, Dijah Rose Diana Carr. Jerry Anna Maria Ferraria, Natalia M. Gutierrez, Delaney Josephine Hafener, Jordan Alaya Henry, Julia Marie Yannick. Sophia R. Jenis, Abigail Rose Johnson, Jesse Alicia Krim, Jalen Gildo LaCourt, Caitlin D. Lesnack, Bridget H. McKenna. Daniela Joanne Martins. Ryan Ricarte Mora. Joshua Michael Tecumseh Nassar. Christian Manuel Languera. Emily Rose Leopold. Abby Kathleen Martin, Maggie Lynn Murphy, Alson Hanley Walsh, Mercedes E. Tilbet, Gina Martirana, Brianna Noel Orico. Ellie Nina Moore, Danielle Taylor McLaughlin, Melina Payano, Sarah Elizabeth Perry, Jeremy Dean Piankowitz. Carrie Rabuse, Jake Andrew Rubenstein, Lauren L. Ruhairo, Rafael Angel Reyes, Janique Yabeth Rivera Aponte. Cynthia Marie Placus, Sadeja Diane Thomas, Devin Claire Rooney, Annalise Tritt Meyer McCarthy, Emily Grace Saltman. Emily Elizabeth Schneider, Dakim Adonis Stockton, Ethan B. Tolan, 
Zoe Serene Hines. Kelly Elizabeth Turtel. Mr. President, on behalf of the Faculty of Arts Management in Entrepreneurship, I now have the honor to present the candidates for the degree of Master of Arts. Errol Patrick Han Hankin. Charlotte Elise Harrow. Interim Director of Dance, Nellie Van Bommel, will help welcome to the stage the degree candidates in dance. <laughs> Mr. President, on behalf of the Faculty of Dance, I have the honor to present the candidates for the degree of Bachelor of Fine Arts. Olivia Arendt. <laughs> Simeon Barber. Gabriel Eden Berger. Jonice Soraya Boykins. Carmen Tyler Cage. Laura Maria Corella. Nicole Marie Carana. Alice Hilda Chacon. Alexandria Nicole Claire. Nikki Marie Darnault. Kylie Ann Dolaway. Anna Catherine Hooper. Christiana Leah Hunt. <laughs> Jung E. Bobby Hewn. Alana Jones. Bethany Christina Kellner. Claire Lucille Kendall. Lauren Twomley. Christina Marissa Katsopoulos. Madeline Riley Lalone. Sarah Yvonne Lipinski. Juan Yu Lee. Lee Sing Ray. Juliet Renee Mazzola. Mary Caroline McGrath. Matthew Christopher McLaughlin. Paulina Gail Marcialis Meneses. Madeline Noel Meyer. Mercedes Alexis Mize. Megan Elizabeth Phillips. Emily Pratt. Ramos. Melanie Marie Ramos. Demiana Hope Remick. Sasha Ridlitsky. Meredith Catherine Santoro. Shara Lynn Shipman. Mary Amelia Speed. Joy Marie Thompson. Jada Janae Williams. 
Hu Ching, Sabrina Wong. Win Tui Wyckoff. It's now my pleasure to introduce Suzanne Kessler, Dean of the School of Liberal Arts and Sciences. Augustine Zarzosa Chair, School of Film and Media Studies, will help welcome to the stage the degree candidates in Film and Media Studies. Mr. President, on behalf of the Faculty of Film and Media Studies, I have the honor to present the candidates for the degree of Bachelor of Arts and Bachelor of Fine Arts. Paola Beatriz Alba Rincon. Rachel Taran Antonsen. May Aoki. Emmeline C. Alcantara. Lee Evelyn Ashton Pusheen. Ryan Baker. Sabrina Angeline Balducci. Jordan Jeffrey Baruch. Charlotte Elizabeth Batten. Zoe Tracy Beard. Paris Winter Bito. Felicity Melinda Bell. Sarah Catherine Blowen. Catherine Elizabeth Carroll. Anissa Lorenzi Bucorizia. Amelia Gemma Carter. Timothy Robert Coakley. Olivia N. Butler. Connor Colfer. Odonis Colin. Dylan Cronk. Alyssa Christina DeMarco. Lillian Dixon. Isaiah T. Leakes. Luis Herrera. Wilfredo Dominish. Virginia May Edinger. Haley Amolia Evans. Caitlin Elizabeth Forcier. Alyssa Jordan Friedman. Yuris J. Francisco. Michael Freeman. Alexandra Paola Garcia Ortiz. Jake Evan Gomez. Orion Halliburton. Justice K Justin Keith Hess. Emma Grace Myers. Mary Grace Higby. Ashley Louise Hiz. Miranda Hollingswood. Nora Ellen Kenny. Nicholas Christopher Kaido. Kevin Patrick Hopkins. Grace Catherine Ives. 
Xavier Najim King. Thomas Reed Kirtley. Tatiana Lise Kugel Hoyal. Justice Lavon Lacey. Dominic Mendez. Robin Charles Mendoza. Stephen Otto Oli. Michael Ademiju Oneteri. Christian Manuel Longuera. Brianna Noel Orico. Brandon David Palacios. John Scott Patterson. Amanda Sophia Persaud. <laughs> Brian O. Peterkin. <laughs> Michael Piantini. Thomas Reed Peter Pieroni. Corey Adam Quinto. Gabriel A. Ramirez. May Rum. Dailiza Michelle Sanchez Osorio. Matthew J. Scafaldi. Jordan Tyler Schmidt. Elisha Daniel, Daniel Shaheen. Annie Rose Alston Folensby. Kara Kind. <laughs> Tristan Joseph Stafford. Wyatt James Tanum. Elliot Frances Torres. Matthew Tuckerman. Peter Aldo Vicchio. Nicholas Hamlin Ryan Viagas. Patrick Gillick Weil. Danilus Wong. Madalena Albu. Brandon Hugo Arroyo. Anthony Gabriel Ciciri. Melvin Cheng. David Joseph Foley. Renaissance M. Frances. That M is for Mercedes. <laughs> Chad Hazine Hilton. Aiden J. Mikulsku. Lee Manor. Noah Michael Marthaler. Sebastian Manjush. Christian Ortega. Erica J. Paparella. James Wyatt Parker. Griffin Thomas Rapp. Paulan Rose.
Daniela Jade Scarantino. Michael Anthony Scarnati. Dylan Joseph Scott. Tristan Neil Torres. Chair of Humanities, Ross Daly, will help welcome to the stage the Duree Candidates in Humanities. <laughs> Mr. President, on behalf of the Faculty of Humanities, I have the honor to present the candidates for the degree of Bachelor of Arts. Maria Gabriela Butarte Leon. Jocelyn Michelle Alvarenga. Kukua Asian. Ujani Basil Dutas. Madeline Elaine Bodendorf. Jeffrey Cabrera. Carly Sandra Campbell. Christy Lynn Capiello. Anna Karen Cervantes. Tony Ann Catherine Chinese. Jeffrey Preter Crowley. Kayla Adrian Dale. Jordan Deeb. Patricia Alfonsina Tavares. Amanda Nevada Demel. Andrew William Jong. Devin Douglas. Alia El Jamal. Henry Painter David Ellison. Aiden Elias Engel Bradley. Aaron Marie Farrell. Louisa Anna Fenichel. Mary Elizabeth Fennell. Joseph M. Fuimara. Camille Grace Fleming. Daniela Rosmina Franceschetti. Sid Freiberger. Dolan Wells Gallagher. William Garrity. Eden Getz. Louis Daniel Gutierrez. Genesis Guzman. Sebastian Hallowell. Stella Hines. Marissa Rose Healy. Ben Havey. Josie Hulin. Tatiana Josie Hulin. Max Landis Kupperberg. John Nickerson Lasoe. Ambar Inez Lopez. Rebecca Isabel Lujan. 
Kirby Luvens Marcelin. Okay. Jonathan N. Mendez. Tyree McRae. Demetrius Tyree McRae. Catherine Grace Michelle. Lauren Minkle. Lucia? Lucia Elizabeth Murphy. Nayara? Nayara Nagati. Hey, hey. Louis James Otero. Ari Joshua Pauls. Nicholas Joseph Perillo. Alyssa Marie Finkst. Ali Ponce Shilo. Anne Marie Prinsloo Murdoch. Marcello Ramirez. Virginia Jean Redlon. Haley Restivo. Simone Roberta Ritchie. Daniel Asher Rosensweet. Elizabeth Ann Shack. Sebastian Bernard Singh. Rose Chandler Smith. Rebecca Lynn Sterling. Rosa Marie Sugarman. Zachary James Prekpalai. Antonina Rose Fiore. Alicia Jolyn Shepard. Stephen Michael Hernandez. Thusen? Max A. Thusen. Caitlin Elena Toby. Juan Gabriel Torres. Natalie Laquan Trotter. Anna Sabina. Kelsey Ann Timpone. Ryan Xavier Vanderbeek. Esther Altamira Vargas. Amalia Liliana Vasquez. Joel Enrique Viveros. Brian Trevor Whittingham. Lynn Nguyen. Ferdous Madani. Mr. President, on behalf of the Faculty of Humanities, I now have the honor to present the candidate for the degree of Master of Arts. Stefano Luigi Guida. <laughs> Alyssa Michelle Calura. Rosa Alexandra Sudal. Assistant Dean, School of Liberal Arts and Sciences, and Director of Liberal Studies, Trudy Milburn, will help welcome to the stage degree candidates in Liberal Studies. 
Mr. President, on behalf of the faculty of the School of Liberal Studies and Continuing Education, I have the honor to present the candidates for the degree of Bachelor of Arts and Bachelor of Science. Joanna Marianella Acosta. Robert David Ashkenaz. Melvin Jerome Banks. Kiwan R. Bibi. Travis Bennett. Alexandra Nicole Bierenbaum. Emily A. Blumenthal. Patricia Marie Boarisic. Julianne Willie Brodsky. Austin Archer Brown. Kimberly Esther Brunasaw. Jennifer Ann Burke. Thomas Paul Burke. Christina Marie Cambria. Matthew Christopher Capers. Haley Rose Cohen. Sandra Wells Kalakani. Islan Anjum Dar. Nakeem Tishan De Leon. Daniel, Ma Daniel Max Demopoulos. Allison Grace Dodd. Michael Westorf Draper. Amy Lifshaw Dvorsky. Bianca Huguette Edward. Whitney Rachel Edward. Hanin Maher El Jamal. Marina Golikova. Dante John Fecate. Rebecca Lillian Feliciano. Samantha Marie Figueroa. Carrie Ann Ford. Emmett James Freeman. Kristen Elise Fricchioni. Danielle K. DiNapoli. Jordan Gaspard. Anna R. Gelfand. Margarita Gill. Kojo Gordon. Khalif Isaiah Grant. Soichiro Imai. Catherine Conroy Halstead. Quinton Jackson. Kareem Michael Hayward Capers. Tony Dolly Hughes. Megan Grace Jeffrey. 
Zebulon Towers, Jowers, sorry. Stephen Daniel Kahn. Nicole Cholera. Dennis Patrick Kevney. Amanda Karen Kelly. Dimani K. Key. Michael Howard Kempel. Nicholas W. Kiriakos. Dane Joseph Kranjek. Luca Austin Leopardo Brunt. Sally Lucille Marty Rosian. Tamara Melissa McCallum. Eliezer Mercado. Sadie Lagata McMurrin. Hamza Asim Jameen. Jacqueline Nascimento. Jonathan R. Parks. Cabela M. Perry. Francis Alexis Minaya. Elena Miranda. Diana Lucia Morgro Bonilla. Elizabeth Angelica Munoz. Julianne Rose Alori. Kristen Carey O'Reilly. Chantel Nilda Ortega. Monica Ortiz. Petrasco. Alexandra Petrasco. Julissa Polino. Nora Paholka. Chelsea Nicole Reyes. Dorissa Elizabeth Reyes. Christopher Ryer. Karina Mariella Ribera. Angelique F. Richards. Jasmine Marie Rosa. Alejandro Rosario. Danielle Rose. Catherine M. Sanchez. Jester R. Sanchez. Kyle Lawrence Sandor. John Paul Saravia. Jonathan Sage. Dylan Scafidi. Dylan Scafidi. Julie Elizabeth Schwab. Spano? Anthony Rocco Spano. Courtney Spruels. Joanna Lisa Tobing. Ames Trinkle. Kristen Idalis Oyeda. Kristen Idalis Oyeda. Elizabeth Ashley Velez. Christopher Joseph Williams. Um, 
Emanuela Teresa Ute. Leslie Christine Zedlovich. Paulina Aguilar. Cole Albender. Apaya. Evelyn Apaya. Harry Richard Backer. Christina Blanding. Latrice Bohannon. Roman Broberg. Erin Elizabeth Burns. Haley Callahan. Kimberly Giselle Carlo. Joseph Lewis Chiafalo. Matthew Claffey. Teresa Rose Collins. Nicholas Cozin. Ashley Christina Elliott. Sarah Gebrunigas. Richard Charles Gullen. Kyle Goodman. Ashley Jem Grant. Matthew Charles Harris. Ashley Hyde. Isaiah R. Jacobson. Eric A. Johnson. Joanna Latino. Francis Gregory McConnell. Kenneth Scott McDonnell. Sharnice Nicole Miller. Olivia Marin Olinger. Gabriel Rinaldo Paez. Salvador V. Palmieri. Kyle Rice. Ryan S. Rivera. Brittany Liz Rodriguez. Tanasia Monet Wright. Amanda Rose Russell. Melissa Salgado Guayar. Jesse Sanchez. Allison Elizabeth Sarcon. Victoria Gonzalez Slater. Dorian Stewart. Luke Leo Sweeney. Shelley Denise Welsh. Marsha Simone Wilson. Bray Brabri Norman Wacoma. Sarah Elizabeth Wood. Joseph David Workman. Jared C. Wyatt. Bianca Taylor Yamin.
The Director for the Conservatory of Music, Jennifer Underkoffler, will help welcome to the stage the degree candidates in music. On behalf of the Faculty of Music, I have the honor to present the candidates for the degree of Bachelor of Music. Leah Markowitz Woods. Acey. Jacob Corey Acey. Antonio Pacheco Adorno. Charlie Arbelize. Daniel Michael Armetta. Samuel Barna. Alejandro Onesto Bercera. Taylor Janine Burgess. Julia Jade Capello. Daniel Thomas Caro. Rachel Shabbat. Saul Kozme. Dan E. Costello. Brendan Cowan. Sebastian Gill. Kira. Kira Goidel. Nick Green. Hunter Green. <laughs> Zachary Isaac Cummings. Fallon. Shane F. Fallon. Hafner. Delaney Josephine Hafner. Matthew Edward Hall. Havy. Ben W. Havy. Olani. Kayla Ann Iwane. <laughs> Kenneth John Camping. Joshua Ray Kinney. Porchmar. 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 Stella Emmett Porchmar. <laughs> Marcella Avelina Berry. <laughs> Kelly Rose Quigley. <laughs> Haley Restivo. Matthew Robert Mantione. Matthew Robert Mantione. <laughs> Gina Martorana. Annie McLean. Mara. Stephen Alexander Mara. Michione. Michione. William Michione. Norberto. Norberto. Joshua Norberto. Bryn. Erica Bryn Lubman. Carrie E. Osman. Sean Francis Power. Rhea? Yeah, Rhea. Michael Joseph Rhea. Jacob Joseph Rivera. Albanese? Rosemary Kelly Albanese. Scheiber? Faith Scheiber Cochran. Chase Robert Andrzejewski. Abrielle. Abrielle Scharf. My bad. Ari Zizzo.
Eric Andrew Steiniger. Taylor Simpson. Tarantino. Lucy Marie Tarantino. Savion Allen Lamar Washington. Bobby Joshua Woody. Mr. President, on behalf of the Faculty of Music, I now have the honor to present the candidates for the degree of Master of Music in Artist Diploma. Christina Avali. Austin Rose Alianalo. Christine Cherry. Daniel Criado Cabrales. Casey Elizabeth Cronin. Hyun Ju. Jamin Jun. Jamin Jun. Jessica Pauline Nessen. Ochoa. Ali Fernando Ochoa Enriquez. William James Pegg. William Richard Sheik. Shi Wang. There's a lot of uh, talking. Could you try to lower it a little bit? Thank you. Hello. Chair of Natural and Social Sciences, Linda Bestone. will help welcome to the stage the degree candidates in natural and social sciences. Mr. President, on behalf of the faculty of natural and social sciences, I have the honor to present the candidates for the degree of Bachelor of Arts and Bachelor of Science. Sarah Ann Solja King. Avaluna Acosta. Daniela Isabel Aguilar. David Aguilar. Jinde Akinlele. Jinar Antar. Camille Alcena Anthony. Ashley Aristi. Catherine Ellen Appas. Liana Yvonne Aviles Nibanko. Anais Oweba Baptiste. Bertram A. Barnes. Diana Barrigan. Quinn Tracy Barrett. Michael L. Battersby. Taylor Ashley Beto. Megan Pilar Behan. Jordan Phillips. 
Joe Borges. Nina Brennan. Alina Claire Brophy. Sarah Elizabeth Brothers. Connor Patrick Brown. Haley Carol Ann Brown. Samantha C. Bruhert. Donovan Michael Bryan. Melissa Cabello. Jada Ramia Nicole Cheek. Christy Lynn Capiello. Oscar A. Capriel. Adan Sid Gonzalez. Pamela Antonia Colin Grigas. Deandra Nicole Conyers. Imali Corcoran. Logan Francisco De Castro. Lisette Angelica De Jesus. Aaron Matthew De Macy. Elizabeth Ng. Darren Dempster. Grace Ann De Natale. Veroli Jordana Diaz. Devin Clark DiPiero. Nicholas Kane Ducci. Patrick Ryan Durney. Jasmine Catherine Incalada. Kurt Fallheimer. Joseph Andrew Ferriola. Samantha Maria Amaya Fishman. Adam Nicholas Galimi. Juan Xavier, Xavier Gomez. Sarah Louise Graham. Clive Griffiths. Alexandra Maria Grin. Yamalit Guzman. William Vincent Hancock. Rose Him. Anthony Lawrence Urilo. Rowan M. Jamal. Zachary Dylan Juman. Fatima B. Kamal. Paris Winter B2. Stella L. Hines. Richard Nishan Karen Filian. Lisa Marie Kentris. Bonnie Lee Caster. Brittany Lee Cock. Yeah. 
Jean-Seph Yola. Genevieve H. Quam. Timothy Isaac Quark. Brandon Lolly. Nicole Page Lancia. Emma Page Lanvey. Carly Ann Laplace. Justin Andrew Leak. Carmen Wang Lee. Frankie Christopher Lofaro. Thomas A. Longo. Amber Inez Lopez. Cassandra Lopez. Christine Valerie Lorenzo. Camille Lowe. Cassandra Maldonado. Justice Marin. Dominic Marino. Alexia Marie Mendez. Bianca Mendola. Randy Moran. Liam Paul Nethercott. Jonathan Scott Obernier. Christopher Robert O'Connor. Thomas D. Ogrodnik. Uh -huh. Julia O'Hara. Peace Okoroji. Moss O'Neill. Kayla Marie Ortiz. Laszlo Andrew Osveth. Daniel Padulo. Katrina V. Papp. Rachel Parker. Normalisa Paukar. Maxwell Pierce. Peter Griffin Phillips. Anna Lorena Pissera. Tiana Christina Pistillo. Abraham Panus, Sid S. Quintana, Nicholas Ramuta, Ellie Renee Rivera, Larissa Maria Rodriguez, Petronia Rodriguez. Yeah. 
Thomas Rogina Jr. Tasia Naomi Lisa Lee Roll. Jennifer L. Rospero. Cindy Blanche. And now, Cindy Blanche Rose. Camille A. Rossiello. David Rowland. Yuta Sakai. Brittany Sanchez. Christina Sanchez. Brian Richard Joseph Strawetsky. Charles Sanford Schwimmer. Luis Ramon Servin. Kieran Mohammed Shabir. Tuba Javed Sheikh. Madison Alexandra Smith. John Paul Sobel. Raymond Charles Stanton. Joseph Stewart. Manaz Sultana. Tajazwi Tatanini. Rafael Tejeda. Jessica Holland Tolby. Thomas J. Tripodi. Karis Sadai Turner. Nicholas Hamlin Ryan Viegas. Khan Vong. Najiana Carmel Walthrest. Sarah M. Weiss. Julia Williams. Abby Danielle Willis. Michael Winter. Chenille A. Wright. Tiffany Alexis Wright. Ileana Jasmine Young. James Edward Young. CJ Zaretsky. Bobby Joshua Woody. Emmeline Alcantara. Paula Frasica. Paula Frasica, one more time. Danielle Felipe Garcia. Adiba Khan. Jessica Lau. Caitlin Laura Lee. Pierce Pedro. Anthony J. White. 
Allison Wong. Director of Theater Arts, Rebecca Rugg, will help welcome to the stage the degree candidates in theater arts. <laughs> Mr. President, on behalf of the Faculty of Theater Arts, I have the honor to present the candidates for the degree of Bachelor of Arts and Bachelor of Fine Arts. <laughs> Tiffany Marie Aguilera. Maria Eileen Albanese. <laughs> Molly Catherine ben Benincasa. <laughs> Brian Walter Boyer. <laughs> Drew Scott Burt. <laughs> Lauren Ann Bastide. Francesco Chiaramella. Allison Elizabeth Eady. Sid Freiberger. Kara Kind. Joshua Michael Tecumseh Nassar. Emily Elizabeth <laughs> Schneider. Hunter Cove. Liam John Connors. Elizabeth M. Corey. William Cosgrove. Lauren Keeley DeLorean. Nicole Kayla Earhart. Virginia May Edinger. Melina D. Fink. Kelsey Ann Ford. Olivia A. Grady. Tyrone Andrew Hodges. Soraya Jones. Kiyo Kamisawa. Atia Shakira Lyles. Michael Anthony Moray. Winter Munez. Dave Richard Lindo. Eleni Aneta Papapodulu. Catherine M. Pelkey. Samuel John Perdick. Micah James Kahino Rabang. Martin Lika Rukal. Casey H. Stavener. Samantha Jade Tamburello. Talia M. Sablon. Dominique Mendez. Lorena Sofia Peralta. Merlixi Ventura. Hello. 
Marjorie Prophet. Christina Sanchez. Daniel Padulo. Najiana Carmel Waltrist. Alexandria Elizabeth Watts. Mackenzie Greer Boffman. Sarah Owen Laheen. Rosanna Nikita Santuarez Lindbarker. Blaze Michael Whopper. Alexa Nicole Roosevelt. McKenna Kathleen Zerschmied. Gabriel Bradley. Hillary Lanique Irene Jones. Claudia J. Logan. Khadija Raquel Perkins. Malik R. Reed. <laughs> Corey Alexander Finzel. Brandon Renee Ocasio. <laughs> Megan Jeanette Johnson. Ashley Ellen Zeitler. Victoria Jean Corbalis. Michael J. Higgins. Alex Mariah Lally. Hi, Caroline Alvarez Millard. William Miller Anderson. Josephine Bassani. Sima Rose Bierenbaum. Ellen Judith Bradford. Victoria Faith Butler. Lindsay Michelle Ragat. Victoria Carbon, Madison Joy Ellis, Audrey May Peterson, Jordan Ray Friedman, Teresa Ann Gregory, Caitlin Kondrak. Kyleen Marguerite Langstone. <laughs> Maxwell J. Lagonia. Elizabeth Barbara Mahoney. Austin Chase Fowler. Joseph Anthony Newman. Bailey Mesa Sachs. Tara Elizabeth Schneider. Nicole C. Swaninger. Hunter William Selby. Travis Wolfgang Lamprecht. Colleen Murray. Neil David Stolting. 
Anderson Nicola Rose Rapavi. Niall David Farmer. Andrew Wenzel. Will all the degree candidates please rise? <laughs> Mr. President, you have here assembled before you the Purchase College degree, can degree candidates of 2018. On behalf of the administration, faculty, and staff of the college, I ask at this time you confer upon them their degrees. Are you expecting something? <laughs> before, we, uh, before I do that, um, I'm going to ask all the attendants in the audience and students, family, friends to please allow the platform party, everyone on stage, to process out down the center aisle so that we may lead the processional with the graduates filing in behind us and then the audience. So please just let us through and stay in your seats and then we will exit in the back and then you are free to exit. Thank you. Upon the authority vested in me by the Chancellor and the Board of Trustees of the State University of New York, I hereby confer upon you the degrees which you have earned and to which you are entitled. Congratulations, you are now graduates. 